Hey guys, it's Flynn. Today I've come up with a spaghetti recipe. It is going to be a chili chicken spaghetti. It's not a chili chicken spaghetti, it is a chili chicken spaghetti. In this recipe, all we're going to do is use chili. It's really spicy. Everyone, is, everyone will love it. We don't need much spices in this. It's just chili. And also, when we're using the vegetables, it's mostly chili because bell peppers, which are capsicums, they're also a sort of chili. So everything is chili in this. First, we're going to make the chicken marinade. Then we'll boil the pasta and put it all together with all the capsicums and the onions. It's really delicious. Everyone will love it. I hope you try it. So let's get on to making it. First, I'm going to cut up the chicken. For that here, I have 150 grams of boneless chicken. If you want, you can use chicken with bones also. And for my pasta, I like my chicken to be cut into thin but long pieces. That's the exact same way I'm going to cut the capsicums also, so it's going to look good. You can cut your chicken into any shape you want. And here, that's all cut. Let's prepare the marinade. For that here, I have the chicken. Into it, I'm going to add in a teaspoon of chili powder, a teaspoon of soy sauce and salt as per taste. That's it. We don't need any more spices for the marinade. That's going to be all. If you want, you can replace the chili powder with chili flakes. Now the spices are all mixed up with the chicken and I'm going to set it aside for at least half an hour to get it really well flavorful. Next I'm going to be boiling the spaghetti. For that here I have a saucepan into which I've added in some water. I'm going to pour in some oil and also add in a little bit of salt. I'm using olive oil. And here I have my spaghetti. I'm going to break the spaghetti into half. If you want you can put it as it is. And instead of the spaghetti, you can also use any sort of pasta shape you like or any pasta. It could be wheat pasta or any other shape pasta. Everything will work fine for this recipe. I'm going to put it into the boiling water. I'm going to close the lid and cook it for at least 7 to 10 minutes or until the spaghetti cooks. Next, I have some other vegetables to cut up. Some green chilies, garlic ginger, onion and tomato and I also have three different capsicums these are green, red and yellow you can either use one color anything will do fine but then I'm just using it to give it a nice color just make the spaghetti look colorful if you want you can just go with one color of pepper or you can avoid it also and you can use any other veggies you like it's up to you And now I'm going to cut up the capsicums. I like to cut the capsicums long and thin. Just like how I cut the chicken so it's going to look good in the pasta. You can cut it into any sort of shape you like. It's according to you. Here are the capsicums are cut up. I'm going to cut the rest of it. I have two green chilies, around five cloves of garlic, a piece of ginger, onion and a tomato. So I'm going to cut up all these ingredients. And then we'll get on to the rest of it. By this time my spaghetti is ready, it's perfectly cooked to taste and I'm just going to strain it out and there the spaghetti is. So let's begin making the rest of it. For that here I have the marinated chicken, into a pan I'm just going to put in the chicken with some oil. And I'm just going to fry this chicken until it's halfway cooked. Just halfway cooked because we're going to put it in the pasta along with the pasta again and cook it. So you just need it halfway cooked and after that I'm going to take it out. Take it out with the oil. And I'm going to set this chicken aside. Next into the same oil I'm going to add in the chopped up ginger and garlic. Just saute that. For a little bit. I'm going to add in the onions. 
the green chilies and I've slid the green chilies just into half through the middle. Add some salt. Don't add too much because the chicken has salt, the pasta has salt and you don't want to be eating a salty pasta. Then into it I'm going to add in the chopped up tomatoes and just mix that all up really well. Just close the lid for around 2 minutes and let it cook there. After 2 minutes the tomatoes and the onions everything should have cooked and softened really well. So that's cooked and I'm going to add in some more spices. I have a teaspoon of chili flakes. You can also use chili powder if you want and around a teaspoon of soy sauce. That's it and then just mix it all up together. Once that's mixed up, I'm going to add in the capsicums along with the chicken and I'm also going to put in the pasta. So all the ingredients are in the pan. Now all we got to do is mix. Mix it up really well. Once that's mixed up, I'm going to close the lid and let it sit there for at least 5 minutes and let the rest of the chicken and the capsicums and all the other things cook really well and incorporate in all the flavors. So after around 5 minutes, you'll see that the pasta is totally ready for serving and it's a super delicious pasta. So I'm going to serve the pasta. You can see how good it is, the chicken with all the capsicum, it's really colorful and also really tasty. If you love spicy food, you should try this, it's really amazing. And there the pasta is ready. Thank you so much for watching, hope you liked it and if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up down below. Also subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Thanks once again and bye bye.